everybody welcome back to the channel live well i'm hoping that we're all doing well guys yeah um today i'm going to be growing strawberries guys strawberries you know we've got an allotment and you know we've got some fruits you know just like how we got the plum tree over there we may want some fruits guys in the summer so strawberries so um so about two three years ago i started off with like say six strawberries i bought from you know in the supermarket you get you know six strawberries in a little in some cells and they've just overgrown in my garden you know what i mean so that was a perfect place for me to get the the suckers so to speak yeah so yeah so what i've done is i've gone into my back garden collected as much as i could you know and i'm gonna be growing them here today guys yeah so hopefully you know we're gonna have some nice fruits for the um for the summer to come now i am starting a bit late with these guys we're now what the today's the 12th of april so i'm a little bit late with them but i'm gonna take a chance I'm gonna take a chance guys right so as you can see this is the root system these ones haven't got a, you know a big amount of roots but they should be fine guys they should be fine so i'm gonna make this my strawberry bed for this year guys i may grow some stuff in between them depending all right so i'm just basically if you come close all i'm doing is just making a little slit in the ground like this and pushing it in now this bed i'm growing it in is um this is wood chip that i had here last year that was on the ground and all i've done is just pulled it together and made a bed out of it so i'm gonna go to it and the idea of strawberries guys when you're when you're growing your strawberry you want to put it in yeah but you don't want the crown to be underground so this is the crown here right all of this can go on the ground but you want to make sure that the crown stays above the ground and what i'm gonna do also guys as you can see some of these already have flowers yeah so i'm gonna take off the flowers because i want them to root and I wanted to concentrate on trying to grow rather than concentrating on doing new berries, guys. Take out any of the dead root leaves, dead branches. You don't really need this. So as you can see, this is your strawberry. This is the root section up here is the crown. So anything above the ground is classed as the crown. As you can see here as also, we've got some berries forming. So we're going to take these berries out, guys. We don't want them. Yeah, we, want the, we want the tree or the plant to do roots for now. Establish itself for the next month or so. We want to establish itself for the next month or so, guys. And, you know, give us some strong, big berries rather than some small, weak berries. So the benefit of strawberries, guys, they got manganese in them. I'm trying to get my tongue around it. Manganese. They also got vitamin C, guys, and potassium. So you know, once again, we're dealing with our minerals. And when you grow organically, yes, you know your minerals will be on organic stuff. Right. Let me just take these flowers off. And normally, as well, from from this stage. Should take about three months guys before you start enjoying your strawberries or you know anytime before that yeah but roughly about three months so hopefully summer berries will be on the way guys Two. 
and I do like strawberries, guys. I ain't gonna lie. It's one of the one of my most favorite fruits. Right, guys. So as you know, if we've got an allotment, we need to have as as, much, as well as great vegetables. We also need to grow some sort of fruits, you know. So these are going to be my strawberries for this year, right? As they grow, as things are happening around here, guys, I'm always going to keep you in touch with what I'm doing and how I'm doing it, right? So on that note, guys, I'd like to say, as always, live well and together we grow.